And now for today's gospel. In today's reading, Jacob travels to Egypt with all of his belongings. Joseph meets his father once again, and they were both overcome with emotion at seeing each other. Joseph provides for his family and gives them land in Egypt. Egypt. This is this week's song. The Lord has made known his victory. The Lord has made known his victory. O sing to the Lord a new song, for he has done marvelous things. His right hand and his holy arm have gotten him victory. The Lord has made known his victory. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. Jesus said, Then the kingdom of heaven will be like this. Ten bridesmaids took their lamps and went to meet the bridegroom. Five of them were foolish and five were wise. When the foolish took their lamps, they took no oil with them. But the wise took flasks of oil with their lamps. The bridegroom was delayed of them, became drowsy and slept. But at midnight there was a shout, Look, here's a bridegroom. Come out to meet him. The foolish said to the wise, Give us some of your oil, for our lamps are going out. But the wise replied, No, there there will not be enough for you and for us. You had better go to the dealers and buy some for yourselves. And while they went to buy it, the bridegroom came, and those who were ready went with him into the wedding banquet, and the door was shut. The Gospel of the Lord. Now for the U.S. Pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Honor of the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to thee, Texas, one state under God, one and indivisible. St. Anne Mission Statement. St. Anne Catholic School calls young people to holiness, preparing them to proclaim and live the gospel message of Jesus Christ through the education and formation of the whole person. Hi, I'm Lynn Berber, I'm doing birthdays. However, uh, there are no birthdays on Friday or Saturday. However, there is birthday on Sunday, Thompson Tran, 7th grade, happy birthday. And on to Jokes with Abram. Thank you, Evan. And now for today's jokes. Where do mermaids find jobs? At the kelp wanted section. <laughs> what do you give a sick lemon? Lemon aid. <laughs> Why do bicycles fall over? Because they're too tired. <laughs> Hi, I'm Mark Baldwin. Hi, I'm Brooks Bosworth. And today I'll be asking Brooks a couple questions about basketball. Brooks, what do you think basketball is going to look like this year? I think it will look the same as last year, because basketball is a sport that cannot change because it is a great sport that we have played for centuries. Brooks, do you think your skill has improved over the pandemic? No. I believe that I've only learned a little bit about basketball over the pandemic and from and from playing all those video games and not being able to go outside, I've gotten worse. That's really sad. Brooks, do you have concerns about COVID during basketball? No, because I've been playing basketball right now for a club and everything has stayed the same, so I don't think there are many concerns. That's all we have? Thank you, Brooks. Hi, I'm Elizabeth LaCant, and this is Paige Free, and I'm going to be interviewing Paige on girls basketball this year. Paige, what are you most hopeful for about basketball? Um, I'm hopeful for that we get a lot of practice in and that we don't have to be farther apart on the court. So what do you think sports will look like this year? I feel like in a way they're going to be the same as last year, but in a way they're not going to be. Do you think it ha will be changed from last year? Um, I don't think it will be too entirely changed. I just think it will be a little bit the same as last year. That's all for today. Thank you, Paige. You're welcome. Thank you, Kennedy and Reese. November service of the month is the Thanksgiving week food drive. You can bring your items in on Monday the night, and you must have your items in by Thursday, November 19th. 
Some suggested items are coffee or tea or hot chocolate, lunch and meat, also known as spam, and ramen noodles. And some other ones are juice, dish up, and gift cards. <laughs> and now on to Lacey and Ella for weather. Today is going to be sunny. The temperature will range from 56 degrees Fahrenheit to 79 degrees Fahrenheit. Winds are at 5 to 10 miles per hour. Precipitation is 10%. Humidity is 55 and 30.16 in air pressure. Now on to Dario for Crusaders of Character. Here are the winners for October's month of responsibility. And KA is Bella Manina, Manina. KB Maya Sullivan, 1A Christian Montau, 1B Eli Yurdy, 2A Cooper Carl and Claire Laskowski, 2B Daniel Reyes Cornell and Stella Tesoro, 3A Grayson Leonard, 3B Hayden Benura, 4A Sonia Minch, and Sebastian Santiago, and Max Tavares, 5A Charlotte Gonzado and London Tran, 5B Cameron Crocker, 6A um, Ella Westlake, and Charlie Newell, 6B Annika Minch, 7A Kate Sadenwater, 7B Elizabeth Wynn and Devin Trish, 8A Sarah Sellers, and 8B Thomas Klein and Sophia Schreier.